Hello, welcome. I'm Patrick Morrissey and this is my guitar workshop. Come on in, we'll take a quick uh, look around. So when you first come in, you'll see these two large ben benches, which is primarily where a lot of the work is done. And um, you'll see that there's two finished guitars here right now. And we'll get back to those after we kind of look around some of the uh, fun tools that I get to work with. At the center of the shop, you have the CNC machine, which is a fantastic uh, piece of technology that helps me create uh, a lot of the parts, a lot of the inlays, um, uh, creating things that are very exact and perfect for every guitar that I make. Um, so this is a centerpiece of the whole shop. And from there, there's various other um, machines for sanding, thicknessing. Uh, if you come over here, you'll definitely see you have the standard drum sander, spindle sander, uh, the disc sander, all hooked up to uh, the dust collector, so it's very clean in here. So over here, we have the vacuum clamping for tops in the back, and this is uh, what I use to uh, glue on the braces. So after you've put the, the glue on the bottom of the braces and you've positioned them, the vacuum clamping creates a uh, consistent clamping force across the entire length of the braces. So this is a top that's nearly complete, but I can only show you what this does. We turn this on. Close it down. And what you have is the clamping pressure from this rubber um, membrane, and it creates a certain amount of pressure across the whole brace. And also, because of the lack of oxygen, it, um, it cures the glue a lot faster. So, after about 15 to 20 minutes, I can undo it. Take it out, clean up some of the glue, squeeze out, and it's you know good to go. What we have here is a very unique uh, combination for this particular body. It has uh, Tunnel 14 Redwood, which is reclaimed redwood from the Northwest. Uh, that's from the 1800s. So this is very special redwood, and the back and sides for this one is Macassar Ebony, which is an amazing. Uh, sounding guitar, but certainly visually it's just stunning. Also with uh, uh, Spalted Maple uh, Rosette with the perimeters being um, uh, Paul Abalone, which will be a really nice, really nice uh, feature when it's under finish. So, so uh, we come here to the bench where we have a finished guitar. This one is the same body shape as the one we saw over there, uh, which is my SJ model. This one also has a uh, Florentine cutout. The perimeter is done with uh, the spalted maple and uh, the spalted maples and the rosette, so it all ties in nicely together with a Brazilian rosewood bridge, Brazilian rosewood fingerboard, the diamond uh, fret markers. And this is a Madagascar back and sides, which is a rosewood, beautiful uh, uh, sounding guitar, uh, very warm type of sound. Also has a uh, slight bevel here, arm bevel, so when your, body, your hand comes over the body, it's really comfortable. And that's what the finished product will look like. So thanks for uh, joining me here at the shop. If you have any questions, please uh, feel free to reach out to me at uh, um, morrisseyguitars.com. You can get a lot of information there, a lot of the models that I offer, um, a lot of the features and the wood choices. So uh, you can find a lot of information there, but uh, also feel free to reach out to me.